Hello there, Eruner here, and today we will make a tier list of chariots in Troy. Let's start with the Dardania. They have heavy Trojan chariots. They are pretty good, above average. And then we got exactly the same chariot for the Hector. Next is Ithaca. They don't have melee chariot, they have a reinforced skirmish chariot instead. Uh, that one is uh, doing slightly worse in the melee compared to other melee chariots, so that's why it will go to the below average tier. Next is Lycia. They also have javelin chariot, they cannot do much damage on melee. And they perform quite similarly as uh, Itaka's chariots. So that's why they will be sharing the C tier. Next we got Mycenae, the Danan or Greek chariots are slightly weaker and cheaper. And they will be our solid uh, average tier. Next we got Paris. Uh, Paris has access to the heavy Trojan chariots as well, but uh, you should be, you can be bringing the Trojan noble chariots instead, uh, not only because of their damage, uh, missile damage, but also they are pretty good strong in melee. Mm, so, and because of this, uh, they are going to be in. Uh, hmm. They are going to be on the top of the A tier. They, they can kill the heavy Trojan chariots. And we have been testing it and Noble Chariot is pretty strong. Then we got Ptaya. They have same access to Reinforced Chariots. And Sparta it is exactly the same. Argos is having same Chariot. Salamis as well. So that was fast. Now the Penthesilea. Sadly, Penthesilea does not have chariot, only one chariot javelins. They are mid tier, they are weak, they cannot do much in melee, and they are pretty much non existent. That's the worst ch chariot roster that you can have. But the other Amazon, uh, the Hippolyta, is having Amazon champions. According to stats, they should be like this average tier. They have similar cost and similar damage. Maybe you will see in battles that they are performing better. But if you look, look closely, this unit is broken and too strong because uh, Amazon Champions are having two models with Spear instead of one. So they are able to deal double damage compared to every other me melee chariot. So that's why Amazon Champions are going to be the strongest chariots we ever had. With the late latest DLC we got Ethiopia and they got Mariano chariots. They are costing same as the reinforced chariots, but with improved uh, combat stats, they perform like heavy Trojan chariots. Uh, so they will be in the above average tier. And lastly, we got Trace with Mars of Diomedes, very expensive uh, chariot only 8 models instead of 12, but what is important with these guys, uh, apart from abilities, they also have two models with spears, so they are able to deal double damage as well, but this time it is intentional. Their performance is same as Amazon Chariots, but Mares of Diomedes are costing appropriately. Uh, so, they will be in the S tier, but uh, they are not cost efficient as Amazon champions. So, do you agree, disagree? 
do you like this tier list? Write comments below. Uh, see you on the Discord and on the next video. Bye bye.